Hello and welcome back to Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. It's the 0 0.16 tournament and this character is gonna be my first and probably only win in the <laughs> in the tournament. <clears throat> and it's gonna be more than a three rune win. That's the plan. And yeah, so last time we had a sort of rough time in the the final level of the vaults but we did get the silver rune there it is so um This time I'm going voluntarily to the abyss. Yeah. To get the rune here. Let's hope we don't get horribly mutated. Apart from that, we should be fairly good. And the uh, plan here is to get to down to level 3 of the abyss as quickly as possible. means we have to just walk around and find or until we find uh, the portals leading deeper into the abyss The rune only appears on level 3 of the abyss or deeper. Hungry, that's nice. I'm gonna eat all my bread rations and stick to meat rations after that. So that our food only takes up one inventory slot. So, <clears throat> yeah, it's gonna be a bit boring this first part at least. this and oh my are you serious <laughs> okay this is incredibly lucky because <clears throat> this is the abyssal rune which is the one we came for of course and we <clears throat> found it right away Getting this rune first. <laughs> Seriously, four less than five minutes. <laughs> Let's kill this guy. We have s lots of temporary uh, mutations. That's annoying, but they'll go away soon. 
Alright, so let's find a way out of here. Yeah, that's that's, uh, that's a lot of mutations. But I'll go away soon, like I said. So, oh, dude, you die. Well, <laughs> that's quicker than I expected. Wow, five minutes and fifty seconds since I started the video. So, and we have gone to the abyss, gotten the rune, and gotten out. Excellent. <laughs> now what? Um, I think we should go to Zot <coughs> and do at least the first four floors. Hopefully gain at least one level. And after that, it's really time for the the cool stuff, like pandemonium and hell. Oh yeah. So, let's... No. There we go. Alright, insert the silver rune, the decaying rune, and the gossamer rune. Here we are. Oh, I still have some nasty mutations. Okay, they are going away. What happened? I'm being smitten. Oops. Okay, let's let's be careful and let's be not get overconfident. I want to heal a bit now. Maybe get some heroism going. Wow. Why is this golden dragon so nasty? Dude! Uh. I'm... I'm not gonna die, so let's blink, yes. It's the last blink scroll, but it's better better to use it than to die. So I'm gonna go, gonna go there, and there, and out. Wow, dude. Mm. 
Okay, let's try again with full HP. Shouldn't be a huge problem. Yeah. Got a hat from Okovaru. And it's a hat of Sea Invisible, that's nice, but... I have other sources of Sea Invisible. There's the ring. Fire resistance wouldn't hurt. Um, I don't really have any good sources for that, so... Charges, okay. <clears throat> Are there other recharge? There's one down in the Orkish mines, okay. source of resist electricity hmm. maybe I should have taken those with me those aren't bad like these ones <clears throat> better in the like general but a source of resist electricity would be nice Let's actually go back and get these.
Okay, <clears throat> so now we have that. Um, lot two. <clears throat> We're so close to level twenty six. Ah, there we go. an electric golem. This could be a good time to actually use these gloves. The dex minus four does take my evasion down a little bit, but I don't think that matters much. And training dodging took us from our, I think it was eight evasion to four or sixteen, so that's good. Um, let's give evocation to Let's get evocations to level 20 just for the sake of doing it. Um, dude here I'm not gonna be bothered with putting on this invisible ring even because it's fine <clears throat> let's put next uh, new an exclusion on this door because there's probably something fun inside I'm just curious if we use this war axe of speed and the buckler of resistance, we do get more fire and cold resistance. But is the war axe good enough? Let's give it a try. Are so good. <gasps> it's an orb of fire. <sighs> As we know, these guys are terribly horrible, so to speak. make an illusion of myself. Um, can you see invisible? Yes.
Whew. Okay. is full. Yay. Hello. Ooh, a manual in there. Okay, and do we dare to go in here? Let's close the door and let them come here. Let's do this again. <clears throat> you yeah oh god some demons and hellfire and yeah okay oh no corrosion more corrosion Okay, good. 
invocations. Well, I guess we can train it a little bit, you know, just for, <laughs> I don't know. <clears throat> Well, we will, we, 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 we are gonna switch gods at some point, so, hmm, okay, yes, invocations will be very good for <clears throat> the abilities the Shining One will give us, and we might even use some of the other good gods, like Elevalon or Zin. Um, well, maybe not a living on, though. Anyway, yes. And we are kind of soon fighting an armor. We'll be maxed, well, relatively soon. Um, let's do this when we have the manual. Um, so we might be able to get some spell casting of. Rather simple spells, so let's. Oh, what crap, have I picked up now? Yeah, we might get to learn some simple spells. Hmm. Let's just drop something here. Check out these books Book of the Dragon. No. of the Zealot. Wow, it's, <laughs> it's an artifact spellbook. So nice. <clears throat> very, whoops, very nice spells, but, whoops. Papyrus of Fire and Brimstone. Also an artifact. <clears throat> it's a fan of Gales. And I haven't been too convinced it's very good, so. There's lots of books. I could get some simple spells like blink or or something might be useful and possible. <laughs> That's it for Zot two. Um, Artifact leather armor, yay. No. <laughs> Come here.
Another circle, all the things. Oh. Teleport is a bit risky. Um, or heal. Heroism. Could teleport. Okay, good. Killer clowns. Well, one at least. Select me, that's okay. Now we're good. That's the invocations finished. Um, I guess we'll leave it at that for now and get some fighting and armor. Oops. Okay, it's a hellion. Nasty things. Oh shit, he blinked me away. Why do I even try? 
Okay. <clears throat> Can't have enough of those. Red ration, I don't care. Let's just eat it. Zot four. <clears throat> Do one more floor here. Okay, that's a lot. Okay, we're rotting and all kinds of shit now. That's Yes. Fine. Let me get away. And cure all this. Okay, that was... <clears throat> I do have a throwing skill, but... Well, I kind of should get some javelins, perhaps. And there's level 27. Strength, intelligence, or dexterity. Intelligence for the spellcasting plan. Well, I don't think we really need more strength. It wouldn't hurt, but I think I'll go dexterity. Yeah, I took my evasion up one point. Triple sword. <clears throat> hmm. Kind of. I 
must admit I do like my axis, but let's let's identify this one. Slice minus tally, rage, resist cold, dex plus nine. Wow. But we have no sword skill whatsoever. Why do you give me this, Okavaru? Why couldn't this be an executioner's axe? And minus telly. No. Disc of storms. Uh, well, since I have resist electricity now, that's. Cool. Let's just try this disc of storms. See what it does. Okay, that's what it does. <laughs> the Lich has summoned a whole lot of horrible crap. How does this disc of storm does it not have to recharge? Oh, he's filled with an inner flame is going to explode when I kill him. I think, yeah. how well it works anymore but there used to be a cool trick you can do when entering <coughs> waltz level 5 uh, especially if you're a spellcaster and can easily blink away um, you could enter waltz 5 and then read a scroll of immolation which will make all those guys around the entrance be filled with an inner flame like like you saw here um, and if you then blink away and start spamming like uh, firestorm or whatever fireball or some kind of spell that makes one of the enemies explode then um, You could set up like a chain reaction where one explosion leads to the death of the next monster and so on. Okay, there's a lot of liches here. Another gift. Tomahawks. Library. <laughs> oh, don't say they're all mimics. This one wasn't. Book of Battle. Can I just do this? Okay. 
leather bound book. Have to drop something. Will I ever use this one again? Probably not. Just see. Gives two more points of AC, but I do prefer gold dragon armor, so I'm actually going to drop this and never regret. <laughs> Tempests, no. Minor magic, this could be good. Uh, yeah, blink. memorize it good so maybe at some point we will maybe at some point we will do something train spell casting skills of the dragon the warp Control teleport. Don't really think that's reasonable to believe we can learn that one, but as it would be um, <clears throat> wait a minute there are rings of wizardry around that could help with the <clears throat> spell casting plan changes no Okay, that's it for Zot 4. And I think that's it for this video as well. We are at 50 minutes, so this is a good point to end it. So thank you all for watching, and um, I hope you'll join me again next time when I think it might be time to abandon Okavaru. Yeah, I think that's the next step now. The only things left before Zot 5 is <clears throat> Hell, Pandemonium, maybe Slime, but I haven't really been there after they changed the whole corrosion mechanics, so not sure how well that's gonna go. So I guess the plan is to um, start worshipping the Shining One instead, then go to the Crypt to rapidly gain piety, because the Shining One, unless that's been changed, the Shining One really likes, likes it when you kill undead and uh, stuff like that, so yeah, I think that's the next step. Um, Alright, thank you for watching and goodbye for now.